All right, guys, from the game, um, Foster didn't return with the hamstring, Exum with the concussion, and Tart with the shoulder. You guys eliminated the, uh, the turnovers in this game. What was the, the, the reason for the loss in your eyes? Uh, we, we didn't score enough points, and you know, our defense gave us a very good chance to win that, you know, getting us those three turnovers, getting us a 12-point lead. Didn't capitalize on them enough with touchdowns, and then we didn't make the plays at the end uh, when we needed to. Uh, yeah, they switched up their personnel. First time they went base defense this year. Uh, that's about it. What did you make of CJ today? Um, yeah, I mean, he did a good job not turning the ball over. Um, but no, no one on offense had a very, very good day. On that last scoring drive, there, there were two runs at the very end when he got close to the goal line, two runs by Beathard. Why, why, you know, those two calls, why not something, you know, in the end zone, throwing into the end zone? Um, what well, one was a zone read and they missed the snap, so he just had to eat it. You know, he would have given it because the defense DN was up the field and they bobbled it. Uh, I didn't see what happened with the snap on the exchange, and the next one was a quarterback draw. Um, you know, they've been doing three man rushes, putting everyone in the end zone, so that was the way we wanted to attack it and uh, thought we had a chance and they made a good tackle on the play. Yeah, Brandon, with the No, just all three of them are going. I know Raheem went out during the game. Um, I'm not sure exactly what it was, but he got a little banged up in the game, and um, and he only came back in, I think, for a couple plays. Uh, anybody else? Phillips? Cal, uh, there's been some reports about the trade deadline. Uh, Pierre Garcon, what do you need to say about that? Uh, we love Pierre back, just trying to get his knee healthy, which he's very close to. I expect him to be good for Thursday night. Uh, yeah, we've looked into everything, so um, you know teams have talked about him, and it is a possibility, but nothing for sure right now. Have you kept him abreast while it's going on? Yes, yeah. Are there any other players that you haven't talked about or teams have called about? Uh, teams call about a lot of people. Uh, you know, I think every team around the league is doing a ton, so I know there was a report on Pierre, so... Um, that is true. He's one of the guys that people have asked about and we have talked about, but um, nothing is going down right now. We'll see how these next two days play out with Pierre and a lot of people. How did Jimmy play? Jimmy Ward played for safety today. What went into that decision? Um, from what I saw, he played well. You know, what went into that decision is one of our best 11 players out there, you know, and um, Jimmy started out this year at corner, you know, giving us some insurance, you know, with Sherm coming off that injury. Um, throughout the whole off season, but you know Jimmy started last year at safety with us and played at a um, very high level when he was healthy. So um, with us losing Colbert, um, with getting Sherm back this week and Akello, uh, that it made very good sense to put Jimmy at safety. But when you're down to your third string strong safety like that, it's obviously it's not a position you want to be in. But do you look back thinking maybe we could have done something different coverage wise in, in those situations? Uh, yeah, I think we mixed up a bunch of coverages. You know, it's. Um, you know, the ones they scored on, I believe, was the uh, Tampa 2 zone. And they also got us in some man coverages, too. So I think we switched it up throughout that whole time. You know, they just made some good plays and ended up beating us there at the end. Um, but yeah, losing Tart and Exum was tough. Kyle, do you ever worry that with just the, the string of kind of heartbreaking losses and just you know, the, the nature in which you've lost the, the team is going to sink? I mean, it's tough. You know, you always, I mean, guys are really hurting in there, and they should be if if they weren't. Something's wrong with them. Um, but this is our job. This is what we do. This is our livelihood. Um, you know, we're not happy at all with where this season's gone, and there's still a half a season to play. So um, we need to step it up, and we need to do something about it. No one's um, season's not ending. You know, we're not going to sit here and run away. Um, I want guys who are going to come out and fight. I thought our guys did fight today. Uh, we just didn't do it well enough, and I'm going to continue coaching them, trying to get us better in every aspect. I know our guys are working to get better, um, but we weren't good enough today, and you know Thursday can't come quick enough. What was your message to those men after the game? Um, you know, there, there's not many words that can you can say that can make them feel better right now. Um, I appreciate how hard they fought, um, but you know when you can't, when you come up short, you, you got to man up and you got to deal with it. There's not much you can say right there after a loss. Um, what you can say is how do we respond these next four days, just working and not feeling sorry for ourselves. Um, I understand that you know what we did was is not good enough, and we're as upset about that as anyone, if not more. Um, we got four days to fix it, and sitting around feeling sorry for yourself or pointing the finger isn't going to help us do anything. Uh, we need to get better in every facet and find a way to win on Thursday. A couple more. I think, uh, I think 
Horn ended up uh, leading the team and uh, receiving yards. How do you think he did coming in for Peter? Um, the opportunities he got, I thought he did a good job. Made some plays, gave us a chance there at the end. Um, but yeah, it seemed like Horn did a pretty good job. Can you talk about the time you had to try to see to call a timeout in the morning? What's that? Yeah, there was just some confusion coming out of the huddle on one in particular. Um, called a timeout on another. Just didn't like the look that we had. All right. Thanks. We're going to bring uh, Thanks, Sherman sir. and uh, Beth.